So here we have a tub of uh, Atatexana queens. If you look, some of them have already started dropping their pellets. Let's see if we can find one and zoom into it. So that right there is a little fungus pellet, which is what they'll use to start their garden. There's another one right there. So they tend to drop them when they're really stressed out. So as you see in the bottom of the bucket, there are loads of fungus pellets. So we'll have to collect all of these in order to give them to them prior to setting up. But I'll go ahead and pan through the bucket real quick just so we can admire the colors. They're a little bit more maroon than I've seen in previous years just because they're from a different population. And then every so often you'll get real lucky and you'll get one of the small roaches that actually live with the Attic Gardens. So this roach is in the genus, I believe, Atophyla. So that roach will ride on the back of the queens and then eat the fungus that they eat as well. It's a really cool symbiotic relationship. More of a parasite, but still an interesting find. I've never been successful in having the roaches within a colony. Usually they die in the founding stages along with the queens. So I'll try this year. No promises, but we'll give it our best go.